Schizophrenia is not a new disease like AIDS or COVID. It's afflicted humankind since the beginning of recorded history. However, in the absence of scientific knowledge, mental illness was defined by the cultural beliefs of the period. In ancient times, people believed that schizophrenia was due to spiritual possession. You could be demonic or you could be saintly. In the Middle Ages, abnormal behaviors caused by schizophrenia were attributed to moral deviance or religious heresy. It wasn't until the Enlightenment period of the late 18th century that schizophrenia was regarded as a naturally occurring condition. But in doing so, physicians invoked preposterous explanations for what caused the illness. In psychiatry's case with schizophrenia, they often blamed the parents, particularly the mother, saying that they were over-involved with the child or they emasculated the father. These spurious theories spawned ineffective and often barbaric treatments like malaria therapy and notoriously prefrontal lobotomies. Only in the middle of the 20th century and the chance discovery of the first truly therapeutic drug revealed the disturbance in the brain that caused the characteristic psychotic symptoms of schizophrenia. This breakthrough formed the scientific cornerstone of psychiatry and launched the age of psychopharmacology.